complete, turn the key off. This is complete. I'm gonna come back again and see what I have, what is left. BCM body control module. BCM and ABS programming. I don't want to do anything on that because I don't want to get into uh, trouble of. Uh, Editing this, editing that. You see, you have ABS coding programming. The only thing I'm gonna go back and check. Okay, this is what I have. I don't want to do that. Back, close. Now I'm gonna go to the car. Okay, we're gonna wait for the, the the computer diagnosis to see if there's any code. Before we have a code for on the diagnostic system. This is the latest software 3.10 4.40. Please subscribe, share, and like. And uh, thank you for your support. Okay, say yes. Say yes. They say I have two days. Now they say I have two days. Before they say one day. Two days is not bad. This is the car, you have to put your username password here. I gotta go enter. Uh oh, I need this too. Anything that I can go with it. Prepare order on the system. Maybe the, the, the software is mismatched because Maybe the compute the transmission software is already up to date uh, comparing to the engine tra comp engine software data there is no codes you remember before we have a code gotta go back go back let me see if anything is good Yes. Look okay. I don't see no problem. Let me see the transmission. What we have? DTC. No DTC. But let me do something else. Let me BCM TCM reset. Do I need that?
India should not run. Okay. Engine should not run. Turn the ignition switch off. On now. Because they want you to turn the ignition off. TCM cleared. Click OK. Dada. Let me show you Dada now. Things that we need to know. Let me start the car. Look here. Solenoid. Okay, let me see if I can. You see here, P indicator is on. Let me go to reverse, only reverse. You see now, P indicator is off. R natural. So it show you if it's working or not. Okay. Also, we have a switch. The switch also. This is an indicator, and this is a switch. If anything not working, it will tell you. Okay, pressure, solenoid, and here it gives you the data what it is. What is the APT switch? Here is the repair, which is so good. Look at it. <laughs> you know, like you will have some information that you cannot get it on the regular scanner. This is why if you want, when, when the shifter level is shifted to P position, the automatic P switch indicate on. That means there is a switch and there is a shifter. The transmission range switch is attached to the control shaft. Operate, operation of the shift lever makes the control shift rotate via the switch cable. That's how it works. And here is where all this information that can help you locate it. You can read, read, and do all what you can do. So this is a ground. You put it here. It's sent to the computer. And this is the switch. You're going to go to another one. Okay, go to this one. What is this? LCC liner solenoid actuator. This parameter show LCC liner actuator. LCC command. Pressure control solenoid. What it is? Where is located? Please, if you want to, if you want to have uh, a, a good understanding of. Honda function software, how does it work, where is located, how the wire is, it will tell you by using a okay, pressure control solenoid. Also, another place. If you have a subscription for the wiring diagram, it will tell you PCMH, G sensor current, uh, current sensing, drive pulley control solenoid, it will give you the drive pulley control solenoid is here. If you come here, this is the value supposed to be the correct value. If anything that more than this is not acceptable. Look here. Where it is, how it's working inside the diagram of the car. You can read it and understand how it, any code you have in the car, go and and spend some time and you will have a lot of this is only an idea how you go there and you have for example engine speed i'm talking the engine speed which is a crankshaft sensor engine engine speed is converted from the crankshaft sensor ckp so it is there now vehicle speed how we know vehicle speed kilo mile an hour mile per hour or kilometer per hour vehicle speed converted from cvt speed sensor so you know exactly what you're looking for okay input shaft drive pulley speed sensor input shaft drive pulley speed sensor if you get a code where it is input shaft drive pulley speed sensor convert cvt input shaft drive pulley speed sensor the cvt input shaft drive speed sensor detect the number of revolution of the gear you know like it is very simple and you need to get it uh, get you know like how those things working if you go back to the engine, 
let me show you that's why paying getting some information it will help you do a lot of stuff let me go to the trust engine for the engine let me go show you data I still I don't have no codes I don't have no codes so I gotta go to data and then from the data the same thing let me see what it say engine speed same thing same vehicle speed here he give you more details see and maybe he give you the wiring diagram too you see how it is magnet hole effect does the signal is working that's how it is please now let me go to this car have two cooling temperature sensor now you want to know about the cooling temperature sensor is here definitely you will get more information about it how does it work and don't forget this car have two cooling temperature sensor you see how it's working minus to up the engineering yes anything and now I give you something about another cooling temperature sensor this is show you one sensor on the radiator side If we are going talking about about Honda Honda original software if you're working on Honda you see now here I have the airbag light on forget about this let's go back I never see that airbag light on but let's go again and I give you why you're using a Honda software which will help you please consider that consider educate ourselves and spend more time on this you see here SRS and SWS seed weight detection or something I want to see what data I have no codes and why the light is on maybe still they have a sometime if there is no code and you see the light on that means really uh, there is there is a the, the, there is an accident in this car for example and they fix it but the airbag control module may need to be uh, adjusted data let me see what data is there I have all the data for example this is as I told you you see this this is stuck does this this car have a, an accident and uh, they never fix it yet that's why the airbag light is stay on all the time for example if I put this one here look here clip it let's look at the green one at the top the red one on the top left front seat belt buckle I'm gonna clip it see if you clip it you're gonna change to green take it out clip it the right side also so that's how the system work we spend our time and fix it the right way thank you for what uh, following us and thank you for supporting my channel reaching 12,000 subscribers please subscribe share and like and see you in another video this is Muhammad Harun Idris